Hey everyone, in today's video, I'm going to do a simple guide of installing your SNES 9X EX Plus on an Android device together with an Xbox One gamepad and share some of the issues that I've encountered during making this video. Please don't forget to leave a sub or a like to this video and it will only take a minute to do. This will help me make more videos like this. Hello, my name is Fredo and you're watching Project Agent. First things first, you need an Android phone, a gamepad, and your games. Also, I've left all the links in the description box below in case you want to try it out for yourself. Let's get back to business. First, you need to install the SNX 9X from the Google Play. It's very straightforward. You just need to search and click the install button. Once you've installed it, you can straight away go to your settings. In my experience, I've only adjusted the aspect ratio to full screen and disabled the virtual gamepad since we're going to use a physical controller. Next, we need to connect the controller using a Bluetooth connection and enable the gamepad input setup by clicking the auto detect device to set up. Click any buttons on your gamepad and it will instantly detect a generic gamepad or Xbox controller. Congratulations! You can now play your SNES games, however, I did encounter some issues with other devices. I tried to remove and reinstall the app, but still doesn't detect and map my controller correctly and ended up using my Realme GT 5G. It's very minor, although playing with an on-screen controller is kinda cringy. I hope the developer will address this small issue. Anyway, if you don't get any issues or whatsoever with your gamepad, then you're ready to save your games to your root folder and start gaming. To begin playing, all you have to do is to point the game content you want and it will appear and just open to start the game. And you're now able to play your favorite SNES games. I've also tested this emulator with some of the other gamepads such as the PS4 controller, iPeg 918 and the GameSir X2 gamepad. But my advice here, if you want to have a full experience of the SNES gaming, I would go buy the 8-bit though SN30. I have plans on buying this controller soon and hope to do a review with this emulator in 2022. For now, I'm going to use my Xbox controller and time travel from the old days. That's all I have for now. I've left all the links in the description box below. Hope you find this video helpful. Let me know if you have anything that you want me to do. And as always, have a good game everyone. Peace.